Shivers. I don't need Shiverson's permission to take my own car out. You guys hungry? What, do you have a death wish? Can I take your order? Do you really make your own ice cream? With our very own hands. Three vanilla shakes will be fine. Are you trying to get at me, Richie? Richie? Richie Rich, that's your name, isn't it? I would say that you're poor. Judging from that lazy grin, I'd say you're not too bright either. Hey, cut it out! Get out! Okay, oh, come on, let's just go, man. Hey, I want to know one thing before I go. What freaks you out more? Getting bailed out by your girlfriend or knowing that she was adding me to her fantasy file? What did he say? I think he just said, come kick my ass. I'd be willing to dismiss all charges in this case. The boys volunteer for community service, working with the crew rebuilding Mabel's table. Good afternoon, classmates and invited guests. As new graduates, we look forward with hope to the future. At what point in our lives do we begin thinking about the past and the future? When I was a child, I never gave them much thought. I miss those days. Robert Frost once wrote about his carefree youth climbing the branches of birch trees. So I was once myself a swinger of birches. And so I dream of going back to be. So do I, Mr. Frost. You ready? I'm not hungry. We invite you over for lunch. You decide to sit out here like a really big baby. I'm hot. Let me go get something to drink. Meet me tonight. I heard your speech. You what? I saw you walking. You followed me? Life is too much like a pathless wood where your face burns and... I'd like to get away from Earth a while and then come back to it and begin over. We have a 4th of July dance coming up next week. Come with me. This is beautiful. My favorite spot. So anyway, there's this 4th of July dance. I would be honored to be your date. I kind of have to go with Jasper. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Uh -huh. I mean, it's not like we got some serious thing. Right. I see my blindness now. And since I now a proud member of this town, then I should be allowed to go, right? Hey, what's up? Are you drunk? No. Right, maybe better go, huh? Go. Hey, I just got here. What's going on? I can't be with you. What? No, stop saying that. No, nobody knows you like I do, all right? Nobody sees you like I do. I love you, Sam. I have to go. Can you show me around your mansion? This is a house. How about I take the tour myself? Marco. Game's over. Samantha, get out of the tub. What's the matter? My mother loved her roses. She would just sit in here for hours and stare at them. In the summers when I was a kid, she used to take me outside to stand in the rain. I found her in the tub. 
Water was so thick with blood, it looked like paint. I always knew my mother was sad, you know? She didn't say a word. She just gave up. What is it you think you're walking into? A relationship? He's gonna be gone in a few weeks. You're not gonna hear from him again. I'm looking for Samantha. I haven't seen her. Is everything okay? Yeah. I love this spot. It's like heaven. Right here on Earth. Let's race. <laughs> Samantha, what is it? <laughs> when you tell someone you've had cancer, no matter how you say it, they just end up feeling sorry for you. And I didn't want you feeling sorry for me. But if it can save you, then it won't. It's already spread. Even with the treatment, the best they can offer is a chance I could live a year or two. It's not worth it. So what? You're just gonna give up? You're just gonna die? going to live, but just not as long as you. I haven't been a very good friend. You've been my best friend. I really do love you. I love you too. What's she doing? You care so much, why don't you go down and see her? I've got a life to get back to. Do you know how much it kills me every time that I see her look at you? No matter how much it tears me up inside to see you with her, get over your shit so that you can be with her. Because she needs you right now. And whether you want to admit it or not, you need her too. You don't know anything about me. Well, I know a lot more now, don't I? Boy, you know, I wish you'd never met that Kelly. Some people live their whole lives and never fall in love. I lived my life and I fell in love. You hanging in there? Hanging would definitely describe it. But you know that I will run. As you all know, we have a brand new lover's wall. Just I'd like to go by climbing a birch tree, climb black branches up a snow white trunk toward heaven. One could do worse than be a swinger of birches. <laughs> <laughs>